Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I will be showing you how I apply my wing eyeliner and I'm using a gel and a liquid eyeliner. As you can see, I already applied some concealer on my eyelid to even out my skin tone. And then moving on to gel eyeliner, I'm using the MAC 210 brush because it's very small and tiny and that's why I like it. I always start by drawing a line because that way I'm going to decide which way my wing will go. I like my wing to be very long. If you don't like that, just make it your own and make it a little bit shorter if you want to. Uh, the gel liner I'm using is Black Track also by MAC. Then I'm going to connect the middle part of the wing with the middle part of my eye, like this. And I'm making sure that my line is very straight and I don't have any bumps in my eyeliner. And then I'm going to the middle part of my eye, connecting it with the outer part of my eye. And I'm just going back and forth just as long as I need to, to make the perfect wing. Well, perfect, but you know what I mean. And then I'm just filling in my wing and making sure that I don't see any skin peeping through and making sure everything is nice and black. For the inner part of my eye, I try to make my line as thin as possible. That's why I'm using the tip of the brush. Uh, sometimes it's very thin, sometimes it's very thick. It just depends on the day and if my wing goes on the way I want it to be. See, and we're done with the wing. Well almost. Um, because I didn't apply any concealer yet, I'm using a flat brush with some eye remover to make my wing uh, a little bit more sharp and we are done with the gel eyeliner. Let's go to liquid eyeliner. The way I apply my winged eyeliner using liquid liner is actually the same as gel eyeliner. Although I think that when I use liquid liner, it is a little bit faster. And as you can see, I'm just starting off with making my wing like this. Then I'm going to the inner corner of my eye and I'm dragging it towards my wing. And as you can see, I messed up and I used my finger to get rid of it. And then I'm just fixing it with some liquid liner. And here I'm just filling in the wing. As you can see with my uh, with the gel eyeliner and with the liquid liner, I tend to pull my skin a little bit. I try not to do it that harsh because I know it's not good for your skin, but that's just the way I do it. I wish I could do it otherwise, but hey, <laughs> I can't. Ta-da! I can't sing. <laughs> and because lately I have some dark circles around my eyes. I'm just color correcting using an orange corrector. And of course I'm going in with the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in the color NC35. And later on I will be blending it all in with a sponge. The closer I get towards my wing, I try to be as careful as possible because once the concealer is on the wing, it's not so easy to fix it. Well, you can, but I don't want to because I want it to be perfect. That's just who I am and how I like my wing. And 
then I'm going in with some mascara because I will be applying false lashes. Not too dramatic. Well, <laughs> for me, it's not so dramatic. Um, these are actually very long, especially at the end of the lash. Um, but that's just how I like it. For me, this is very natural because they're not as thick. They are long though, but yeah, <laughs> I love long lashes. And then I'm setting my concealer with some powder. This is the MAC Mineralize in Medium Golden. And then I'm going over it with some loose powder. This is a yellow one, also by MAC. I believe it's a pro powder. I love it because it gives me a highlighted look and my concealer doesn't crease. And of course, I'm finishing with some eye cold in my waterline as usual. And for my left eye, I'm applying some mascara for my false lash. And as you can see, I use way too much eyelash glue. This is a darker one by Duo, but that's okay. Um, I will be going in with some liquid liner on top of the eyelash glue, just to make sure that my eyeliner doesn't get shiny because eye glue on the eyeliner makes your eyeliner shiny. Wow, that was hard to see. <laughs> be careful when doing this. Don't mess up your line and we are done. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you want to ask me something, feel free to comment down below and I will talk to you soon. Bye bye.